Hey, what up, dudes and vids? I'm Christian from Beers R Us, and today I'm gonna bring you a little haul. Well, I think it's gonna be a big haul from action figures. And uh, well, as you can see, I haven't done any videos, but uh, well, it's because I'm in a new job and uh, my schedule changed, so I'm getting a hang of it. And now, well, I'm gonna have a little chance here to do the video. Um, first I'm gonna give you the things that I bought from yesterday and today, okay? Blocked Hard from Marvel Legends. I have seen the reviews of this guy and they say that it's not cool. And he's a badass. I mean, he looks badass. The only bad thing is his tail, but uh... I'm gonna do the review and I'm gonna explain why. So yeah, Blocked Hard. Pretty awesome. I, if I box, I bought it like this. And it's free pretty cool. So yesterday I bought this head of the Brute Queen. Pretty awesome. I bought it. Why? Because I have the body. So now I have the head. <laughs> now I'm lacking only a lot of stuff. <laughs> but yeah, I'm gonna, I'm gonna try to form this beast. Yesterday I bought Austin Powers, the first movie. Pretty cool. It's a little bit uh, damage here on the top, but on the other side it's cool. I'm gonna try to, uh, I don't know what you call it, pull it, or uh, I don't know, we use the machine to take out this these things. Yeah, the box that I like, so pretty cool. Also, I, I bought the mask, and I thought it was in English only, but uh, it's, the, it's the Spanish one, so it says uh, La Mascara, and I mean the Mexican one, La Mascara. Uh, here and, uh, on the top it says Los Texas Inédito de New Line Cinema, it's like uh, the greatest hits of uh, Cinema Line or something like that. The Mask, pretty awesome movie. I really pleased to have this movie on my collection now. So add two di add two DVDs more to the DVD collection. And today I bought this Wolverine, Mighty Mug, pretty cool. Has a little bit of. Uh, things here and there, but it's cool looking, man, I mean, if you put it on display, you're not gonna notice. Only five cents, dude, it's pretty awesome. Really like this guy. The claws look awesome. His yellow suit, awesome. Also, I bought this guy, you know, I don't remember the name of this guy, but uh, it's from the X-Men Classic line, and it's pretty cool. Five cents also, pretty awesome. And it's almost minty fresh only this thing here it's got a little scratch here on the eye can you see that the the white stuff is like a scratch so I can paint that green and also today I grabbed uh, Gran Turismo 2 pretty awesome love this racing game for the PlayStation 1 has the two discs they are quite nice they're not like too much uh, scratch or stuff like that but I think it's playable if I have problems, I can do something. A friend of mine has a, a machine to to make the, the CDs cool again. And it has a manual also. I don't know if it has two manuals like the first one, but uh, it has this manual. Pretty awesome. Uh, this is what cost me around two bucks and uh, 50 cents, something like that. So it's awesome. And also today I bought this Donny. You know, this is... I bought it because I remember when they come out on the and the cartoons like this so pretty cool when they come in with the code it's supposed to be in disguise and <laughs> nobody noticed there's a troll inside of this <laughs> pretty cool I'm going to show you a trade that I did on my new job with a friend I trade like uh, 6 or 7 Star Wars figures with no accessories for this big ass dude He's lacking on something in the back and something in here in this little peg that it has here. But I don't care man, he looks so badass. Really don't care. He's awesome. Like this big mama jama. I will do the review of this, of course. Just wait for it. And also today I bought this guy. I have a, uh, I think it's Raph and Leonardo. I think I'm only missing Donatello from this crazy turtles. So I'm gonna have the four of them now. 
I know that it's lacking of the belt, but uh, I don't care. I found like this, and it's uh, it's in a cool cool condition, so pretty cool. Check out the crazy eyes. <laughs> and also yesterday I bought this guy. I have it already, but I didn't have the back pad, so I just bought it because of that. It was like a dollar. Uh, I was like, ah oh, man, I already have it, and I have the belt, but I didn't have the backpack, so. And I think I have somewhere else, I have the, the thing that goes inside of here, so I'm gonna search for it also. But yeah, now I have the complete, almost complete, so pretty cool. Now I'm gonna give you something that I bought a long time ago and I haven't shown you. But this uh, Future Toy is from the Vintage, it's from 1990. I think it's missing something here, like a cockpit or something. But now I have it, so pretty cool. Also, I pick up this Bebop. Uh, Leo, I already told you that this guy is crazy. Check out this thing. Oh man, that, that thing gets stuck. So he's like a samurai or something like that. Supposed to come out and just put it in. Like an armor, so pretty cool bebop, right? And also it's from 1993, so pretty cool. Okay, now this, also I bought it a uh, long time ago, is uh, Mr. Freeze. Uh, classic line from Batman, I think it's from the animated series. This is I wish they they throw this uh, Mr. Freeze in the in the DC Universe line, the six inch, with this suit, nothing too fancy like the one that we know. Just this, very simple, but it's classic and it's awesome. He looks awesome like this. Just check out the face very seriously. I mean the story on this guy on the on the animated series is amazing. I don't know how it's in the comics, but it's awesome on the animated series, so love this guy. Also, I have here Dark Seed. Seed or Side, or I don't know how the hell you you gonna pronounce that. But uh, I don't know from where it is. I think it's from uh, Justice League Unlimited or something like that. Pretty cool figure. I like the face on this guy. Looks pretty menacing, like always. But this Joker, I don't like this Joker. I really don't. But, uh,. He was like in five, in five cents, so I just pick it up. So don't like this Joker, but uh, like more the classic one that I have. But this one, I just don't don't care about this. But well, now I have now I have a Splinter from the from the animated uh, movie. I think it was in uh, 2007 the movie or 2005. I don't know, but I have this. Uh, Master Splinter, pretty cool. Pretty nice. I found it at home, my mom gave it to me, so pretty awesome. A friend of mine gave me this figure, and well, he gave me also another one Ultimate Warrior. Loved this guy from when I was a kid. And I, he's like a, a gladiator, like a corner or something like that. He's b really badass. It's a shame that uh, they take take him out and something happened there in the wrestling. And Hulk Hogan also, classic Hulk Hogan. Pretty awesome. The only bad thing is that the fingers are cut off. Check out this. I mean, they're pretty fragile fingers. They're like hard plastic and really fragile. So the kid must uh, destroy it or something like that. But my friend gave it to me, so it was awesome. Well, I think that's it, dudes, and I uh, hope you enjoyed my uh, figures, my new gets and stuff. So yeah, Ultimate Warrior, Hulk Hogan, or the last. And uh, well, I'm gonna do be, um, reviews of some of them. I don't know if I'm gonna review all of them, just the badass ones. But yeah, pretty nice. Uh, now I got something cool to review. This is awesome. So expect something more from the next week. And I will continue, my friends. I will not let you down. All right. Oh yeah, that limbo dude. Check out this. I just made it black. I'm just uh, checking it out how it's gonna look black. But I'm gonna paint silver on it, you know, so it can look like I don't know, like wear out or something like that. I wanted to see like super shredder, like worn out. I don't know, like really rusty and stuff. So I'm gonna just paint uh just brush brush some silver onto it and uh, I think I'm gonna do a hole here and I need to I need to get a brain like a like a crank or something like that so I can do like 
like the Utrinians or Utrun, Utrans dudes from from the comic and put it in there so I can relate it with the comic as you can uh, say that uh, Shredder explores explodes on the on the comic so and never comes back I think and also I need well the helmet I already have it I don't know if I'm gonna do something to it but uh yeah I need something here a plaque like armor or something spikes I don't know something uh, but yeah, I mean, I'm thinking, I know, I know, it's taking a long time, but uh, I'm just taking uh, ideas to do a cool figure. I think it's going to be for my collection because I, I'm really delaying on it. So yeah, this is going to be my my prototype, as you can say. I haven't done, done nothing to it, but uh, yeah. I have the other one. If I screw this one up, I can use the other one. So that's cool. That's why I'm using this one. So yeah, all right, Leo, uh, the limbo friends from the YouTube. Uh, that's gonna be all. Thank you for watching, and have yourself a great day. Later on.